Hello, kindergarten. It's Miss Rodriguez again. Today, I am going to be reading to you another informational text called Beehive. Think back to yesterday. Our informational text was called Buds Need Bees, and we learned that bees help buds make seeds. Today, as we read Beehive, we're going to be trying to answer our read to find out question, what happens inside a beehive? And you're going to make a prediction before we get started. Boys and girls, I want you to go ahead and take out your reading page from our weekly packet. Go ahead and put that in front of you, your little Wednesday reading page. And take out your little Start Right Reader. You can follow along in that or um, watch Miss Rodriguez and follow along. And go ahead and get something to write with and also maybe a, a highlighter or a brightly colored crayon. So as we're reading and you see those sight words, you can highlight them or maybe underline them so they can pop out at you from the page. Go ahead and get your little setup, tighten up your listening ears. And before we start our read, I want to quickly talk about our words to know, our sight words for the week. We know that they are keep, made, why, and would. And yesterday, we put these sight words in a sentence. Today, we're just going to be looking for them as we read. Also, our phonics skill for the week we know is long E. Remember that when you see those double E's together, they make that long E sound E. All right, I think we're ready. Get those pointers ready. Oh, but before we do, I almost forgot. We need to make our prediction. So remember, a prediction is a good guess. A good guess. So think about what you might already know about bees, what you might already know about hives, and write your little prediction on your paper. Remember, a good guess would be something about bees and hives. You wouldn't want to say something like, hmm, I predict that inside of beehives, bees throw big birthday parties, right? That sounds like a lot of fun and silly and exciting, but we know that couldn't really happen. So you want to really stick with what you think is real and, and happens inside of beehives. So go ahead and write down your prediction and we'll get started. Beehive by Lyle Mendoza. And Lyle Mendoza is actually the author from yesterday. Remember, boys and girls? He's the same person that wrote our text yesterday. The sun is up. Buzz, buzz. The bee zips from its hive. It will seek buds so it can feed. Hmm, when does the bee leave the hive? When does the bee leave the hive? Think about that. The sun is up. When does the bee leave the hive? Oh, I need to move my little picture bubble so we can see the words again. Buzz, buzz, buzz. The bee sees buds, big buds. It lands on them and sips. What does the bee do on the buds, boys and girls? What does the bee do on the buds? The bee speeds back to its hive. The bee made it home. Hmm, what is the bee's home? Think about that and answer the question. What is the bee's home? Peek deep in the hive. You will see lots and lots of bees. They feed this big bee. What do the bees do in the hive? What do they do in the hive? Why would bees do that? This big bee is the queen bee. Who is the big bee, boys and girls? Who is that? big bee inside the hive. At last, the sun sets. 
The bees can stop now. They keep still. It is time to sleep. Hmm. What do the bees do when the sun sets? What do the bees do when the sun sets? So remember, our read to find out question was, what happens inside a beehive? You made your little prediction and go ahead and flip over your paper and take a look. You made your prediction and I want you to think about, was your prediction correct? If it was, go ahead and circle yes. And if it wasn't, that's okay. We were just making a good guess and you can circle no. Go ahead and answer the read to find out question, what happens inside a beehive? And you can draw a beautiful little picture to go along with it. Have fun, friends. Thank you so much for letting me read to you again today. I hope you're having a great day. Remember to do your best. Maybe go back and look through your Start Right readers again. Look for those sight words. And I bet after going through them a couple times, you'll be able to read them all by yourself. All right, friends. I'll see you soon. Have a great day. Bye.